I'm Adam Hodak, representing Green Russell as a managing partner and bartender. Today I'll be making a classic New Orleans Sazerac. Um, it's a take on a uh, true cocktail, which includes bitters, sugar, water, and spirit. Um, what really makes this uh, cocktail a classic to New Orleans is the use of uh, Peychaud's bitters. This is a very simple cocktail to make at home. You want to chill your cocktail glass, grab a mixing glass, add a half ounce of water and some raw sugar. Muddle down the sugar cube until it's become partially dissolved. From there, I would add three to four dashes of Peychaud's bitters. Peychaud's bitters is a New Orleans bitters that has a really nice anise backbone. I'll then take two ounces of Maryland rye whiskey. The Leopold's Maryland rye is the whiskey of choice. I break down my block ice into two cubes. One larger stirring cube and the second cube in order to add smaller pieces and a little bit more water into my cocktail. I stir my cocktail until I feel the proper temperature on the outside of the glass and I can see that all the sugar crystals have dissolved. As soon as I empty my cocktail glass of ice, I will rinse it with some locally made Leopold's absinthe. The absinthe itself will add a very nice herbal bouquet to the cocktail. As I rinse the glass, I'm trying to really capture the essence of the absinthe and get those herbal and the somewhat floral notes to come through. I use a julep strainer to prevent any small ice crystals from falling into my cocktail. As soon as I finish straining the cocktail, I will grab some lemon and add just a little bit of citrus oil to the top rounding out the bouquet. Here's a local twist on a classic New Orleans Sazerac.